Hi, this is Amber with American Humane, and I'm the Disaster and Cruelty Response Specialist for American Humane's Rescue Team. Our hearts are with you as we work together to navigate this new and uncertain terrain surrounding COVID-19. The health and well-being of our pets, who have provided us with so much comfort and love during these trying times, is more important now than ever. Today I'm going to respond to some commonly asked questions and concerns surrounding our animals and the current state of COVID-19 as of April 8, 2020. The first question is, can my pet give me COVID-19? According to the CDC, at this time, there is no evidence to suggest that animals, including our pets, can spread COVID-19 to people. The predominant route of transmission for COVID-19 is person to person. With over 1.4 million human cases worldwide and very few reported infections in pets, the risk to animals appears to be quite low. The next question is, but didn't COVID-19 come from animals? Although animals are linked in the origin of COVID-19, there is currently no evidence that animals are playing an ongoing role in its transmission. Therefore, at this point, we should not be concerned about contracting COVID-19 from our pets or our wildlife. The next question is, if I am diagnosed with COVID-19, can I get my pet sick? The CDC and World Organization for Animal Health are advising people who are ill to take extra precautions when handling their pets. If possible, just as you would another member of your family, you should separate from your pets if you are ill. Information about the virus is still evolving and it is always best to play it safe. If you do suspect your pet is ill, please contact your veterinarian immediately. The next question is, what can I do to prepare for my pet's care in case I do become sick? If you do become too ill to physically care for your pet or you need to be hospitalized, who can take over for you? Is there anyone else in your home who could help? Perhaps a neighbor, friend, coworker, or family member can take them in. Even a groomer, daycare, or boarding facility may be able to help in your time of need with some advance notice. The most important thing you can do today is come up with a potential pet plan and talk directly to those people involved so they're prepared in case they're called to action. Now is also the time to prepare a pet supply kit. It may not seem necessary today, but it will become hugely helpful if you find yourself in an emergency situation without the ability to track down proper supplies. Your kit should include contact information, at least two weeks of your pet's food, a crate to safely transport your pet, any veterinary records, collars with ID tags, medications, and contact information for your veterinary clinic. This is also an important time to make sure your pet is microchipped and the information is accurate. We are all in this together and need to do our part to flatten the curve. We need our pets now more than ever to provide us with their unconditional love and support during these trying times. With a plan in place and your whole family on board, you can rest assured knowing your pet will be in the best hands no matter what challenges may arise. From all of us here at American Humane, stay safe, stay strong, and thank you for all that you do for the animals.